Hey guys, welcome back to the Planner Pixie Co. Show and welcome to a week of new releases. I've got a couple of really cool kits for you guys this week. I've got a few foil things, but in the foil things I've got another new product. I'm also going to show you freebies since I haven't yet. And we're still pretty early into September, so I thought I would just go ahead and show them this week with new releases. So everything will go live this Friday the 8th at noon Eastern Standard Time. Everything will be 25% off. Um, and everything this week will be included in printable. So let's go ahead and get into what your freebies look like. That's her journaling card. How ridiculously adorable is that? So all orders will get the journaling card and then also your other all orders freebie is the same format that we've had. I've got three different versions here. I found this humorous. You've got some spider web headers. Oh my god, I'm like literally dead with some bat headers and then fabulous with some spider headers. It's pretty much all uh, ghost themed. Um, I'm showing this one to you in lavender confetti, but these will be very random foils. It'll be a plethora. There's so many good ones that could happen for Halloween, so I didn't want to print off um, and foil all of the ones that I plan on doing. So it's just going to be very random what color that you get. Um, but I feel like lavender confetti is a really good one for October. There's so many kits that come out this year, including both of the ones I have for you this week. Um, that lavender confetti goes with so um that's your all orders freebies right there your um 50 plus freebie is the flags they have some spider webs and then you've got some little bat deco down here your 100 plus freebie is the october sampler i'm showing this one also in lavender confetti and then your 150 plus is the little ghosty all glittered up it's got orange glitter this is a vinyl decal so that is all of your freebies for the month of september if you're a printable buyer uh, where you go to download your orders you should have a link to where you can get to these freebies right here so all right let's go ahead and get into the kits for the week the first up was a request i really wanted to do this art but i feel like everybody did this art so i was like meh Maybe I shouldn't, but it was requested that I do it, so I did it. Asking you shall receive. This one is called Gothic Romance, and I'm glad I did it. I really love this art, and I do think I'm probably going to use this one for our anniversary this year. Um, our anniversary is in October, and I always say that Halloween kits trump any kind of like lovey-dovey kit for me. But I feel like so far it's worked out to where I have like kind of a romantical gothic kit each year, so that works out really well. But Here's what all the boxes look like. It's just so pretty. She did such a good job. So here is your washi sheet. You've got your extra box there. You've got two patterns on your washi. Your solids. Your patterns. And I am showing you our ultimate kit, which is 10 pages. We do still have the eight page full kit in the shop this one has all of the labels all of the rounded boxes you've got two patterns in this one i feel like if you buy this one you should not have to buy all of the extras you shouldn't have to buy labels you shouldn't have to buy patterns it just it cuts the cost i feel like a little bit for you and then there is the deco sheet so um let's go ahead and do foil colors um let's see I think pink hollow could be nice. Lavender hollow as well as just lavender. The lavender confetti. I feel like it just goes with so much. I think Merlot would go with this one. I mean, you do have a couple of red touches in it, but I think it would work. I think my favorite is Hunter Green for this one. That's pretty perfect, honestly like a combo hunter pink hollow hunter lavender hollow maybe i think that looks really good together and then of course your silver hollow your sparkly hollow cracked ice wait till you see the underlays i have for this one i think cracked ice would look pretty cool on that uh of course your silver your matte silver i think even any of the golds would look nice with this one I really do like the Hunter and like a mixture. I think Hunter and Peak Hollow. That's my favorite mixture for that one. So 
All right, let's see. Purchase the ultimate or uh, the full kit, and I'm going to throw in just this weekend only. Your weekend freebie is the extra um, double box scene. So we do have labels. We do have an extra color here. We've got the checklist, we've got patterns, and then we do have a sampler that has a tall box and two regular size boxes. I did pull in that extra color in that box right there. And then let's do your washi options. So you do have two patterns, so I went ahead and did the black, the purple, pink, the green solid, and then the lightning strikes pattern. Okay, that is Gothic Romance. Now, the only other kit I have for you is another one that I just wasn't sure if I was going to do, but I decided, what the heck, a lot of shops did not do it, like shops that I follow. So I thought I would bring it to you guys. So this one is called Eras, and this is of course, Taylor Swift, um, inspired by her tour this year. I am in no way, shape, or form a Swifty, but I do like Taylor Swift. Um, I've enjoyed her music from the beginning, from Tim McGraw on to today, and I have liked, in like, I've enjoyed watching, there's so many TikToks this year about this concert series, and man, she looks like she puts on a heck of a show, like it's just... It looks like th there's a lot to it, right? Like, it's just very theatrical. It's like the most theatrical concert I think I've ever seen in my life. So, um, I do, like, little references. I do kind of know a lot of them just from watching TikToks and such. But, like, her little, you know, her little Easter eggs and stuff like that she does. I have no idea about any of that. But, um... So you do have the big stadium scene here. I put the girl with the heart hands. You've got another like selfie girls here. Then you've got Taylor with that um, that like moss covered piano she's had this year. Maybe she's had it more than just this year. I don't even know. 13 is like her favorite number, right? Or lucky number or something like that. I don't, I don't even know. Um, you've got a sweatshirt here that has like all the tour dates. Um, Miss Americana, is that like a song? I don't even quite know, but I know it's like a Netflix thing, and I did watch that. Um, I don't know what the Cornelia Street is all too well. I feel like that's a song. Um, the hat, I think it's so cool, the hat that they give away, um, during the concert. I feel like that Mama Swift should have been like a part of this kit. I feel like she's such a huge part of the concerts, and... Just explaining things to those of you that don't know. If you're a Swifty, then you know what all of this means. But the hat they give away during a certain song, and I can't even remember what song it is. But um, Mama Swift, Taylor's mom, gets to go through the crowd and pick who gets the hat. And so the person that gets a hat waits at the end of the stage, and Taylor walks out singing that song. And she takes the hat off her head and puts it on whoever's head. I think that's so cool. So you've got like um, some dress up stuff here. I feel like a lot of people look like this going to her concerts. You've got the bracelets that they give away um, to each other, all the fans exchange. You've got some concert tickets, 1989, which is a song, an album. I think just an album, ain't it? I don't know. It might be a song. Um, here's what your washi sheet looks like. You've got her legs here. And then, did you see the little something something I did? Can you see that on the pink part of the washi? This is all of her different albums. I just kind of did it lightly there. I think that looks really cool. And then here is your, um, your colors. I feel like I had a hard time with picking colors for this one because there's just... There's so many colors, right? It's just very colorful. So I think, I think I did good though. I like it. I like the way it turned out. I think these colors go pretty well with most of everything that's in the kit. Here is your um, deco sheet. Purchase the deluxe or not, not the deluxe, the uh, full or the ultimate kit. And I'm going to throw in the double box scene. We do have the labels. We do have the patterns, 
checklist and then I do have another sampler here you've got a tall box of her and then two regular size boxes let's go ahead and do the washi um, I just feel like probably most of you will want to use that one but we do have the other options so we have a solid that would probably look really good with the pink solid navy we've got a light blue We've got a purple, sorry, uh, this one's got something on it. I feel like every week I just get stuff on my examples. But I also was just thinking I didn't do a solid pink because I first left this solid and I even shared that picture in the Facebook group and then decided last minute today to do it like this. So I actually don't have a solid pink one. But I feel like most of you would rather have that one rather than, like if you're going to use pink, you'd rather have that one than the solid. So we're just going to keep it like this. I've got the purple. I've got another pattern there. And then I actually made this one myself. We're going to call this one ombre. I just took all of the different colors of the kit and made this cool design with it. So you've got a pattern and you've got an ombre. Let's go ahead and do foil colors. I think navy would look pretty cool with this one. Um, there's a lot. I think any of the golds would probably work. Matte silver would work. All of like the silver variations. You've got cracked ice, sparkly hollow, silver hollow, lavender hollow. Let's see. I like I like a pink hollow navy combination for this one. I think that looks really good. I do think our indigo would work for this one as well. Blue hollow, uh, maybe even the icy blue. Lavender confetti, and then just lavender. So lots of different foil choices to choose from for both of those kits this week. So that's what I have as far as kits go. Let me get into, I've just got a few foil things, you guys. I did not do like full collections for either of these, but I've got a couple, I've got some things to go with each one. So for the Taylor Swift one, I do have these underlays that have like a bit of, I don't know, different references to Taylor Swift. I'll let you get a closer look. Um, I did this one in navy, so that is your underlays for that. And then I did do like a script overlay, so it says Taylor Swift, the Eras Tour, and then you've got like the little different silhouettes of her. Um, this is what I actually used on the washi. It's just all of her albums. You've got her autograph, and then I just did like a crowd down here. I thought that would be cool. So that's the two that I have for the Taylor kit, and then... I took the lightning bolt situation and did some lightning bolt underlays and I was thinking to those of you that do like the solids and you put these on top how cool would it be to put like black solids and then the lavender confetti on top of that I think that could look pretty cool for this kit so keep that in mind um, I tore all of my stuff up over here. Alright, and then I do have a couple installments of our like scripts. So I'm adding some new fonts to our uh, days of the week and our monthlies. I did both of these in gold. I will start adding different scripts to these as I get the time, probably when I don't have as much foil. But this is one of my favorites that I've been using lately. This is actually one of our customs, which customs are in the shop full time now. This is font number eight if you wanted to match everything. And I will start um, adding to the... Um, our monthly samplers too. I'll start doing different uh, fonts for that. Okay, let me get into what my new thing is. So those of you that watch my plan with me, you know that on my sidebar, I don't really keep up with anything and I like to do like some cute quotes sometimes. I'll just give you an, some examples like my new year was new year, new me, until breakdown. So I like to do ones that have to do with like the week or like 
whatever the kit is. I had COVID that week. Let it snow. I mean, it's pretty much just a overlay script made smaller into the sidebar. Winter is stupid. Game night is my favorite night. Just a few examples, but I got inspired by my lemonade one. Let me find it. It was one of the last ones I did. So with this one, I made it into a square box that just fit perfectly in our half boxes. And I was like, you know what? They would be cute to add a page of like little tiny um, quote overlays that fit into a half box. And I don't know how many times I have been asked to um, take some of the quotes that I use for my sidebar and put them in the shop. So that's what I have for you guys. So I did just three this time. We're going to start with this and see how you guys like them. But they are in that format. They're just a square. And they're going to fit perfectly into a half our half boxes. I mean, I would think they would fit into any. I feel like a half box is a half box is a half box, right? I think they're going to work well for any kit. But the way that I'm going to do them, I thought that I would do like each month and put like hello whatever the month is. And you could either do that on your sidebar, but I was also thinking you guys, if you had like a super boring day or like you didn't use any other quotes on any of your other boxes, but you still wanted to add quotes within your spread, you could take these and just put like your half boxes into your day. And put a quote just like into your day, like into your plans. Wouldn't that be cute too? I think so. Um, so you could either use this on your sidebar or it could be like the very first thing like on October 1st that says, Hello October. But we have Spooky Babe, Happy Halloween, Chills and Thrills, Magic Night, and then Happy Spooky Season. And then I thought these would be super cute. And then this would add a little bit of like extra deco or something within your spread too. Or your sidebar. I think they would look cute on your sidebar. I did do two Halloween ones. This is the only one that's going to have Hello October. That way it won't be a repeat. But there was just so many good ones. So get your spook on. Stay spooky. Squad goals. Hey there pumpkin. Fantastic. Ghouls just want to have fun. And then I did another like little deco one down here. You've got the dancing like pumpkin heads. And then you've got like a cat with a jack-o-lantern and then I did do a November one so we have hello November pumpkin spice everything I'm thankful for sweater weather farm fresh pumpkins apples hayrod cider let's get basted turkey gravy beans and rolls let me see that casserole harvest and then turkey squad and I just wanted to show you just how stinking freaking cute they look I've got this was one of the pre-foiled kits I just want to put them in the like I think it would even look cute in this and it's just like even more foil but they fit just perfectly look at that I think they're so cute and I want to do I want to do one of these it's adorable I love that so much these are gonna be so fun these are gonna be so fun and I'll try to use some some ones that I don't have in like regular overlay boxes but then some of them probably will be repeats too that way you can do both you can do it within the the bigger boxes and also um your half boxes so um that's what that looks like and I think it's super cute and I hope you guys like these like I said I've been asked so many times to bring those quotes but I think that just makes it super easy they're just a square it's nothing like super cut out in the intricate or anything and not only can you use them on your sidebar but you can use them within your spread I feel like you could probably even put these in your monthly somewhere so that is what I have for you this week you guys hope you like everything let me know what you're most excited about what you plan on picking up again they will go live this friday the 8th at noon eastern standard time 25 percent off of everything and i hope to see you in the shop on friday and i will talk to you guys next time bye